Walking, picnicking, and food trucks are all part of the celebration in the heart of the city. Every year around this time marks one of SoCal's largest and longest running two-day Filipino festival. It welcomes families and friends of all cultures and ages to come out and experience the arts, culture, and community. Director of Programming of Grand Park, Julia Diamond, tells us why it was important for the event to come to downtown LA. We started talking to them about bringing this festival here and the park support makes it free. So that's our part of it and we also help them to adapt to the space. The 23rd Annual Festival of Philippine Art and Culture traces its roots as a project developed by the City of Los Angeles in efforts to heal the city through cultural gathering in the light of the LA riots of 1992. The feeling was there's a lot of different cultures here in LA and they don't know how to talk to each other. They don't know about each other, they don't understand each other. And so the city invested a lot of money in supporting cultural communities and giving them an opportunity to express their culture, what it was in their home country, what it's grown into here in Los Angeles. Hi. The event has a series of art exhibits music, traditional food, and dance performances. Non-Filipino Julio Trejo, who attended the festival, shares his thoughts on its influence. It's just fun and it's, the food is delicious, the people are awesome, and there are a lot of similes that I find in, in my culture with Filipino culture. FPAC does a great job of really celebrating Filipino culture, but it also does a great job inviting in other cultures. We like to obviously share our love of food, our strength and community with other people. The Filipino community may not have a part of town that's really associated with one cultural community, but this festival is important for everyone to understand the impact of the Philippines and in one space learn so much. Everyone is welcome to attend where you don't have to be Filipino to enjoy. In Los Angeles, I'm Maria Leal for Valley View News.